Riley skipped school because his elbow hurts. Everyone else is going to do fun stuff, so we're building the panel that works as a wing to put the cattle in the strip and shoot. All right, I found a little couple of sets of cattle that need to be caught. Things are kind of screwy with my help right now. It's the last week of school and there's not a lot of education going on, but lots of entertainment. So they're off on stuff like that. Riley's injured, as you can see during his injured time, he's over there doing welding, but we are not supposed to put him on a horse. So that's the right one. Okay, let's put, all right, let's put that little saddle pad from over there and then that saddle, that'll do, okay. Okay, we put the horse training cowgirl on an actual full-grown horse today. Mama. Here's all the cows she's rounded up. She might have had a little help from a bunch of dead dog, tired dogs. And the cowboy back there on the pony. Doing a bad cameraman job, I'm sorry. Anyways, we're almost to Highway 375. We've been working with these cattle a little bit. You didn't get to see that because I'm either a very bad cow hand or a very bad cameraman, I have to choose. So. Anyway, we're almost down here to Highway 375, across the highway, kind of in those shadows toward the bald mountain right there is the Red Tank Corral. And there's a big mob of cattle right next to it. Riley and Mama's over there. Riley, the poor injured cowboy, can't ride with us. I'm sure he's dying to get on a pickle and come show us how to do it right. He's parked the truck about a half a mile away from the corral to not spook off those cattle that are there. By the time we get there, we will have nothing left of our dogs. They've worked pretty hard to get these tamed down and in a bunch already. So it's going to be pretty iffy whether we can put this tamed down bunch with those fresh ones at the corral and get them in but you know we're gonna try it hopefully we don't lose the 90 and 9 trying to get the other one but so far it's going pretty good brett is just tagging along back there come on up here and help us cowboy come on he's just been kind of tagging behind on his pony just enjoying the nice weather i guess it is a nice day. You got a little bit of cloud cover, so it's not too hot. A little bit of a breeze. Anyway, nice day. Nice help, too. Yeah. There they go across the asphalt. Van Dorsey had a story from when he worked out here about trying to drive cattle across here with freshly painted lines. He claimed they wouldn't wouldn't cross those lines. Had to rope every one of them and drag them across while all the Japanese tourists were snapping pictures of them. I'm sure it was a proud moment for him. Look both ways before you cross the street. There is a semi truck coming, but he's a mile off. We're good. We're good. Come on, dogs, get off the road. All right, we got a little ways farther to the corral. Can you see it yet? It's just kind of a dark spot still. So Riley and Mama, they pulled up here and slammed the gate on that front bunch. So they did good, they got them.
Let's lock them up just like this, then we can kind of keep the two bunches separate. I kind of want to look what we got. But. So there's two extra calves in here, but other than that, we'll have them. Right there at the big yearling bull Riley caught in there. Didn't die, did you? Okay, we're gonna load our horses and dogs, go home, find something for lunch, and then bring the cattle truck back. Yeah. No, uh, we'll bring a white semi with a red trailer. Don't you think? Get them called home and then work through them all in a bunch. I guess we could do that. That is an idea. Get them. We get them in one load, then wouldn't we? I think the cattle will come better this way. We could leave these here. I guess we just bring them hay and lock them in the pond lot right there. That's an idea that I thought of actually. Now me, you gonna load my horse or are you gonna be cameraman? Like a bigger heifer than two yeah, small ones. Yeah, and then two ones. little ones. Okay, okay. Alright. Let's go find lunch. On those two trucks and onto the house to get worked through. Oh. 
gonna load up now. Him, 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 him. <laughs> load up now, let's go. Load up now, let's go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, they're going up now. Load up, let's go. Load up, let's go. Last few should fit on the loading truck. Yeah. Load up, let's go. single one loaded up even got a little extra space in that trailer give us the update on what you got done earlier today Lorenzo we were going to Vegas so we took some of the, the dry blast for coming swap and then the starter for the water truck for our arena and then I don't know batteries what was the story on the starter so the guy just said that it was a 12 volt and then they were gonna look into it and tell us Okay, so we're gonna get the water truck going so we can water the arena and do some roping. And we're gonna get that coming build on the road soon. Had to get the drive lines modified a little bit since the transmission is farther back than it used to be, but the guys down there are gonna get it done. You know you're not supposed to be moving the transmission back at all. You kinda had to, be like, no, if you use the same transmission, it would fit in the same spot. like, no, you want to fit in the same spot. Everybody learns something every day. Yeah, here we go. Oh yeah, that's the sound we like to hear right there.
About three cows at the back of there are turned the wrong way. You got your bright green shirt on, so it's okay. Now you lost your stick. Drop your stick down in the hole. White faced cow's gonna get turned around. Find her way. There we go. Nobody even noticed. Oh, yeah, that cow. There we go. All right, let him go slow now. Let him go slow now. Slow, slow, slow. Easy kill. Easy. Don't tear nothing up. Easy. Easy. Coriani or something. Coriani Longhorn Cross, maybe. I don't know. Somebody's old rope and heifer from 15 years ago. There they go. Right down the alleyway. We're into the yard. Cowboy down there training roping steers in the new arena, showing them the program. Huh? Yeah, let it down most of the way. Let it down, but tie it about like four inches up. Then it's easier to get it up next time. If you let it slam all the way down, it kind of wedges down there and it's hard. Down, 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 down. Tie it, wrap it off right there somewhere. Evil Rob, you can evil. Dirt bike running good, Rob? Did you get the air filter back on it? Did you get the air filter on it? Okay, good. There comes old Reggie Bug. He's been at school. Last week of school. They're just toughing it out. Reggie! Watch the roping cattle, see how they're doing over there. See how training's going. All right, here's the little wing panel that Riley was welding up earlier today. That just feeds the cows around it in this stretch. How's it working? So that buck and shoot closing gate works good to stop them up in this part, huh? There. We need to anchor it somehow, huh?
Lorenzo, we need you. Okay. An unboxing. Go on a YouTube unboxing. Doing this giant puzzle, but we're trying to make air conditioning on this truck. Now we've been running this engine for 30 years in another truck with what? What you call that? Uh, two, 255 air conditioning. Two windows down, going 55 <laughs> miles an hour. However fast you're going. But this time we're trying to get actual air conditioning. So we have ordered a little kit here from Carrick Customs. And this kit is hopefully going to give us AC. What I'm wondering is what all is in it. We have an eight rib 17 belt. We have a pulley. We have a custom built air conditioning compressor mount. And we have the pulley. What we do not have is the thermostat housing and water neck that we need. I ordered one off eBay, but the, it comes down and that's not gonna work. That's gonna be in the way of the belt. So we have to find a thermostat housing that's gonna work. Just one more wrong part that I've ordered that's on its way, and one more right part that I have to try to figure out. There's been several of those. Good mm -hmm. There's been several. Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we'll put this junk away. It asks what's going internet. on on Anchor Brand Ranch. That's how it goes on Anchor Brand Ranch. Yeah, that's how it goes on Anchor Brand Ranch. If you like what you see, hit that like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell. And if you want some Anchor Brand Ranch merch, Click on the link down below. <laughs> that was perfect too. When I did that, I thought when they come in with those. Okay.